Ever since Eric DaCosta took over as the team's general manager, fans have asked the question, how is he going to be different than Ozzie Newsom? Now, I've said several times that I think the two of them have a pretty similar style in terms of how they want to build a team. But now that Eric is in this role, something that's very clear to me is that he loves the gamesmanship that comes particularly with the draft. Eric is a very strategic thinker, and part of that strategy is creating confusion about what the Ravens want to do in the draft. He kicked off yesterday's pre-draft presser by calling it the Liars Luncheon. And he talked about how he loves the idea of throwing teams off the scent. That's one of the fun things about the draft that's, you know, throughout the course of history, you know, the strategic aspect of the draft. I love that, you know, and just as a kid, you know, I love to play Risk. I love to play Monopoly in all those games. To me, this is a game. It's not a game we can afford to lose. So now that we're less than a month away from the draft, I'm sure that means that the rumor mill is gonna get fired up here pretty soon. And keep in mind that you always have to be dubious about what to believe at this time of the year. Now, before I go today, I wanna to give you another reminder about our Touchdown for Teachers program. The deadline is this Friday for you to nominate a great teacher in your life. So don't waste any time on this. We teamed up with M&T Bake on this project and the top three finalists will all receive a grant of $4,000 to the school. Really cool program. And you can nominate the teacher in your life at BaltimoreRavens.com slash teachers. That's it for me on Final Drive. Thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see all of you again tomorrow.